Guys, if you think I stopped making videos, I didn't. I was just ill. Like, that Monday that you saw, the 1st of January, when I did uh, the video, I was ill. Well, I, was, I thought I wasn't ill, but I'm not gonna lie, I was ill. And then for the rest of the week, I was ill. So then I was like, all right, it's either I try to make video rubbish, or I just recover, and then, yeah, I'm better. So yeah, I waited. It's Wednesday today, and I'm feeling good. So my last workout in here was on Monday last week, the first, and it is the tenth today. So it's been nine days, but I was feeling weak in it when I did it on Monday. So now I'm feeling strong, guys. It's like, it's like, it's three degrees, I think. Yeah, it's three degrees. I have gloves on, but I'm not gonna lie. I might need to take them off because I can't grip it. Like, it, it feels slippery when I'm trying to grip it. So I might have to firm it. And I'm sure these bars in this weather's like. Like what? Like, like zero degrees or something. But fam, yeah, man. Let me take these off, guys. I feel like I need to warm up. Probably my shoulders. Oh, you can't hear them clicks in it, but it was clicking. My shoulders. Well, on um, not my shoulders. My back. When I did workout on Monday, which was the first time in this year, um, it just felt like stiff. Obviously, it's because it's the first one and stuff in it. But now, I'm feeling a bit loose. I got a tournament on Saturday, so yeah. But I, I was gonna start with dead hangs, but I'm gonna start with static holds in the pull-up position. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Guys, if you're new, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Let's go. All right, calm. I'm gonna jump and hold it for at least 10 seconds. Oh, oh, oh. My biceps, oh, oh, that hurt more than I thought. Oh, oh. Alright, calm. Forget dead hangs for a second. I'm gonna do one pull up, and then I'm gonna. I think this angle is really good. I like it. I'm gonna do one. I changed bars because the sun was in the way. That one is a bit. Hard. I'm gonna do one pull up, and then two press ups, and I'm gonna do no two pull ups, two press ups. Guys, is that alright? Two pull up, two press. One, two, uh. one, two. Set two. Let's go. One, two. One, two. Set three. Let's go. One. Alright guys, time for some dips. Let's go. I'm feeling strong. Okay. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Go down. Oh, this is easy. This is easy. It's way too easy. I'm gonna spam more dips. Guys, what's the difference between doing dips on this and doing dips on the tall, higher ones? That's 14. Oh. Guys, it's literally two degrees and it's windy. It's ice wind. One, two, three. Slow. I'm gonna be so honest, my hands are freezing. I'm feeling strong today, but my hands are cold, man. 
Like seriously. I need to do some more pull-ups. But I'm cold. Let's go for let's go for let's go for four. Straight legs. Guys, I'm gonna do what they called elevated incline push-ups or whatever. Well, my feet's on the tire, isn't it? I think that's what it's called. Incline. Fam, cha. This one. Okay. S uh, six. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Keep the form, guys. Keep the form. Six. Seven. Eight. Keep the form. Core tight. Nine. Ten. Oh. <sighs> okay, calm. Guys, I'm not gonna lie here. I feel stronger. Like, obviously it sounds stupid because this is the third finger session I've been doing. Obviously I've been eating different, so I'm going to feel a bit lighter. Yeah, I still have bare fat on me. Belly's big. Well, it's not huge, but it's big. Round, like a potato, onion. I'm joking, man. But we have to just stay consistent, literally. And the reason why I'm saying stay consistent, because watch my first video, yeah, where I struggled to do five dips, yeah? And then watch this video. This is only the third video. And I just did 14 dips. Well, so far today. 14, two sets of seven. Obviously it was spread out and stuff, but it's still like, oh, whoa, something's changing. Like he's, he's doing, so do you get what I'm saying? So fam, anything you're doing, man, I'm telling you, stay dedicated, literally. But you have to, Guys, you have to make sure you're eating right. No stupidness food. Like, I was saying to my friend, like, yeah, we're going to stick to this diet or whatever. I can't because I'm trying to cut. I need to get back into shape, like, good shape. Because I have tournaments and running and rah, rah, But the thing is, yeah, I was coming to say, oh, but on birthdays and if we go out and stuff, yeah, we can eat whatever. But now I'm deep in it, yeah. Fam, if you're going to do it, do it properly. There's no point going home or going out one day. Because just because it's a day and it's an occasion, you go and eat whatever you want. Do you get what I'm saying? If you told yourself you're gonna do something, I'm not gonna lie, you have to stick to it. Even if it's hard, like, like, oh, you see everyone around you eating this or eating that, or they're offering, oh, do you want chocolate or brisket? Fam, if you know, if you told yourself, fam, I'm sticking to this no matter what, say it's for seven months, stick to it. Cause I'm telling you, after them seven months are up, you're gonna be so happy. Like, seriously, man. Like, it's serious. Well, let's keep going. Some chin ups. Chin ups, chin ups. Let's do. I don't know. We'll see. One, two, three, four. Guys, that was the best chin ups I've ever done. I know it looks stupid, but I'm being serious. My chin was my chin was actually over the bar. Like, did you see? Did you see? Let me look at it back. I don't know what these are called, but you're gonna stay upright like a handstand and go in it. Oh, no, that's wrong, isn't it, guys? Wait. Four. One more. Five. Was that right? I don't know what they're called. I don't know what they're called. Guys, see me. If you can. Ah! 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 I bang my elbow. Uh, uh. Alright, come on. Guys, I don't know how I'm going to say this, yeah? So you guys understand. Wait, no, that doesn't even make sense because I know what I'm going to say. So me saying that don't make sense. But I was going to say, now I'm waffling. I was going to say, guys, I don't know. I need someone, obviously I could go and sit down and write one training plan, do this, do this, do that, yeah? But the thing is, if I write, if I do that, it could be wrong. Obviously there's nothing there, you can't say, oh, your training plan is wrong because it's your training plan. But the thing is, I don't know how to write a training plan for this. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, if I was like, if I was like, oh, I'm gonna write a training plan for this year, but I wasn't including press-ups or this type of static hold or this dead hang or this, that, do you get what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what to put on the training plan. 
Does that make sense? Like, so if I wrote one, mate, it could be wrong. For all I know, it could be just stupidness. Like, why is he doing this? Why is he doing that? So that's what I'm saying, guys. Write in the comments, yeah? Help me decide, like, whatever, whatever, whatever. And I'll write one and I'll make the video, everything. But, yeah. Let's go do more dips. I'm going to see how many I can do. I'm on 14 right now. So that's the biggest improvement of this session. I'm just feeling good, brother. But let's go. Let's go. This bar is like ice. Okay. One. Twenty-one. Come on, come on. I always talk about stretching, but me, I'm a hypocrite. Well, not a hypocrite. What's the word? I always talk about stretching, but I barely stretch. Like, okay, no. This is the, this is Wednesday. This is the first week I've been training again. But pardon. In general, like, I don't stretch enough, and I'm always saying, well, not say always, because it's only been like two videos. But I'm always saying, oh, make sure you stretch. So the muscles fight in the right way but obviously i say that in general as well but i'm here slacking not stretching so maybe today at home or tomorrow or something what that i'm going to record i'm going to stretch today 100 percent. but i'm going to record like a stretching something routine mate soon because i can't be slacking like this i'm back in here on friday yeah i should be back in here on friday but let's do some more pull-ups because i haven't done them enough i don't know how many i've done today Wait, I did two, four, six. I've done six when I did the press ups. I did, I did five more. No, I did, oh, I've lost track. Let's go. One. Guys, I'm gonna dead hang with my knees bent at 90 degrees. It's very hard, but I can't do the L hold, innit? So, here. You know, I've always wanted to know. Obviously, obviously, I know the answer, but it's like, how does it happen? Like, you see when guys get ripped from calisthenics, but it's like, you're not doing, okay, no, then again, people still do running and blah, blah, blah. But I'm saying like, when you're in here like this, like, how does it make you get ripped arms and this and that? Like, fam, obviously you see the gymnasts and even the calisthenics guys with absolute ripped bodies, yeah? But it's like, where does it come from? Do you get what I'm saying? Obviously it comes from diet and all of that, but like, like fam, you're not lift, like deep, when you're in the gym doing bicep curls, you're lifting a weight. Do you, do you get what I'm saying? You're resisted. Obviously when you're doing chin-ups, you're resisted with your body weight, but it's like, like, I can't describe it. Do you get what I'm saying, dude? My chest and shoulders is a bit tired from the pull-ups, but I'm gonna try to do the L-sit again. I was so bad at it last time. Well, I'm going to be bad at it again, but let's go. Okay. I'm going to do three reps. One. Two. Oh, my gosh. Guys, I'm getting stronger, man. I'm getting stronger. Last one. Okay. Oh, no, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I thought I was hook. The exercise. Supermans. I don't know what they're called, but I'm going to call them Supermans. I did five last time. One. Two. Three. Oh, four. Six. Oh. 
Damn it. strong enough here all right guys if i look like a mess i'm sorry just don't watch it but what do you call it today it was a good workout it wasn't as no okay i wouldn't say it wasn't as long because i definitely that's the most reps i've ever done in an outdoor gym but i didn't do that many like different types of exercises i did dips pull-ups press-ups and that's about it but i think because them static holds and the slow reverse and all of that stuff yeah I don't think I'm, okay, I'm not going to say I'm not strong enough because I, I ain't strong enough to do it. But I'm going to say, like, I can't hold it. Like, I'm too heavy. Like, if I try to hold a static hold, mate, it's literally, the earth is dragging me back down. Yeah, obviously, that's how you practice, by practicing it. But it's like, mate, I, can, I would rather do pull-ups and do five reps than do a static hold for two seconds where I go up and I basically drop back down. Obviously, it sounds stupid, but I'm genuinely being serious. Like, but I'm not going to lie. Today, as an overall workout, I'm really happy with it. Because, fam, that was the most reps I've ever done with, um, with dips. Well, not ever. Well, since, I, since 2020, basically. Done with dips, with pull-ups. My shoulders are actually aching. Holding the phone, do you see how it's dropping slowly? Because my shoulders are tired. But I'm going to the gym later. Going to do some cardio um legs and we'll see in it but yeah guys i'm back home now and fam i'm telling you like even if you even if you're way heavier than me like say you're way bigger whatever yeah i'm telling you stick to it like you feel like oh i'm so fat or oh i'm so this i'm so that but i'm telling you stick to it because you'll be so surprised at how quick you'll improve like obviously i want to say look at me for an example yeah but there's been no like crazy improvement yet. Yeah, I'm doing more dips and pull-ups, but it's not like, oh my days, he's got nuts. No, not yet. Because I can barely do anything. I can't even hold my legs out in a L hold my legs out in a L. Yeah. So you know what I'm saying? But overall, like, if you want to start doing this, I'm telling you, like, just start doing like Just start doing like pull-ups, press-ups, whatever you can do. Like literally right now, me, I'm literally doing whatever I can do. And I'm not going to lie, my arms are tired. But we move, in it. Like they're actually aching. My back is actually aching. But I think partly that is because I haven't been stretching enough. So it's like everything's a bit tighter than it should be. Do you get what I'm saying? But a big part of this like is stretching. I know I keep saying it, but I'm telling you, it's important. Stretch, man. Like, seriously, stretch. But, guys, keep grinding. Stay disciplined. Whatever you're doing, just stay disciplined. Have to stay on it, mine. In it, Luna. Tell them. Tell them, mine. Don't tell them then. Nala. She ain't going to tell them nothing. This sausage is just in the way. But, yeah, guys, remember, all of this is still new to me. Like, this is new. I'm not no calisthenics genius, gymnast or nothing, yeah? Fam, deep, e not deep, even some of the reps I'm doing, yeah, where you literally can see that I'm big. Fam, yeah, I could turn around and say, oh, I'm not going to post it, I want it because my top was up, or I'm not going to post it because of this. Yeah, I consider it like, oh, I don't want them to see this, one. but it's fake. It's fake. It has to be real. Do you get what I'm saying? It has to be, whoa, it has to be real, like, like, you're not, I'm not in the best shape right now, but I'm going to show you guys. I don't want to, but I'm going to show you guys because it's the truth. Because when I am in crazy shape, yeah, because you talk it into existence, yeah, when I'm in crazy shape, people's going to be like, how did you get there? And I'm literally going to turn around and say, consistency. How did you do that? I'll say, go back into my channel nine months ago when I could only do five dips. Do you know what I'm talking about? And stuff like that. But now look. But anyways, I'll see you guys next time in a bit.